Yo, look at these amount of books. <laughs> okay, welcome to this video. It's gonna be an interesting one because uh, I have a lot of books behind me and I just got a bookshelf. This is um, a bookshelf that was in the corner of my room and it was in the corner of my house. It wasn't doing anything and my mom was about to throw it out. But you know, I figured it would do some good in my room. And even though I do say that I don't usually buy books, I still stand by that. I don't usually buy books. Um, but I think over the past few months and also just like digging out old books from different places and also the past few years of reading books, I have accumulated quite a lot of books. Um, just to show you. <laughs> Wow, um, yeah, lots of books and some of them are library books and some of them are, are borrowed books from friends and so we'll see. I'm just gonna arrange the books real quick and then do a quick, I guess like, I don't know, shelf tour? <laughs> okay, uh, this is my yearbook, <laughs> no biggie. I think I'm just gonna put like random books at the bottom. Um, yay, my gender queer book, which I love. Singlet, singlet. I have a whole bunch of singlet here. Air condition nation. Growing up, put a blend. Eating chili crab and pocket folios. And I also have homeless by Liana Damira. Um, I think I did a whole like book haul on Singapore books which I will probably link, so... Um, another kind of gift book again. I haven't actually filled it out. It's the question book, what makes you tick? Uh, yeah, it's probably one of those gift books. Um, yeah. <laughs> the End of Policing. Okay, I have a whole bunch of Versal books here. End of Policing, Revolutionary Feminisms, Betraying Big Brother. How to be anti-capitalist in the 21st century. Post-growth living for an alternative hedonism. Hedonism. <laughs> and Feminist City by Leslie Kern. Um, out of all these books, I actually only really <laughs> finished reading this one. <laughs> I saw this tweet that was like, oh great, another verse will sell. Time to start the year with like tons of unread books. <laughs> oh wait, I still have one more. <clears throat> this is Glitch Feminism, um, a manifesto. Really random books here. So this is uh, Trauma and Recovery. Uh, this is a really, really good book. I think a lot of people talk about The Body Keeps a Score, um, but I think that this was published be before that, and that's where I learned a lot about trauma. Um, this is a really good book. Um, you might be thinking like, Ned, you actually read fiction? You're right, I actually do. <laughs> okay, next, um, Oxford Dictionary of Dance. This is so random. <laughs> the Crucible, I have two versions of this. Let me see where the next version is. Self-made, uh, Creative Lives in Southeast Asia. I really love this, really enjoyed this book. And then another one here, Lontar, The Journal of Southeast Asian Speculative Fiction. So this will be going up into my Singapore and Southeast Asian stack up there. Ballet Modern Dance, A Concise History. I think, as you can tell, my... Yeah, my taste is pretty diverse. The Mixology of an Astrology. Nice, this was a present. <laughs> this is... Wicca. A guide for the solitary practitioner. I'm not sure where I would put this, honestly. Quiet by Susan Cain, a classic. It's gonna go into here. Teach yourself Indonesian. <laughs> I grabbed this in, in from the corner of my home. <laughs> I don't know whether how useful it will be. Let me see where else I can put it. Ah, here's the second version of The Crucible. I have two versions. I studied this um, in secondary school. 
pig that wants to be eaten. I really enjoy this book. It's just a whole series of thought experiments. Like, it's just like a scenario, and then they'll be like, "Okay, um, what do you think about this scenario?" I think it's great. The Second Sex by Simone de Beauvoir. Classic feminist text. Um, I had to read it for a common curriculum back in uni as well. Yeah, it'd be great to revisit some of the writings here, but it is really thick though. Uh, Love of the Fallen City, another common curriculum book that I had. This as well, which is um, The Tempest by Shakespeare. And this one, uh, this is History of Sexuality, my Michael Cole classic, indeed. Okay, a bunch of singlet as well. Here is Books Actually's Gold Standard 2016. I, I don't know when I got this book. Was it a present? Maybe it was. Uh, this is just an anthology of short fiction. Um, and it's 2016! That's like 5 years ago now! What the? <laughs> That's crazy. This song is from the English, from Joshua Ip. A poetry collection. A luxury we must afford. And then this, The Minorities uh, by Sufyan Hakim. I haven't read it yet! I should really get to, write, to reading it. A Little Life by Hanya Yanagihara. Um, I picked this up a bit on an impulse buy, but I think a lot of people were talking about this last year. Not sure whether I'm very keen on reading it. This one, Astonishing Splashes of Colour by Claire Morel. Actually, I really like this book. I, this was a book I picked up long time ago at some random shop. Next, I have uh, Brave New World by Aldous Huxley. Classic text, um, as usual. Okay, I still have quite a lot of books to go through. I have a bunch of magazines. I'm gonna have to find a way to store them. Okay, this is White Behind Mental Health Stigma. Really good book. Um, it's about many different voices of mental health, about mental health in Singapore. The design is just amazing. Um, yeah, really good book. It's independently published as well. We have a whole bunch of uh, library books here, which I should probably return soon. <laughs> okay, this is so haphazard. Uh, the Android's Dream of Electric Sheep. This is a good book. Um, I don't really read fiction, but this was a good book. This is uh, Duty Free Art by Hito Stereo, Art in the Age of Planetary Civil War. Really good book. I read the first two chapters, uh, but it's so brain heavy, like it's so intellectual, um, and so I stopped. But I I must finish this because it's so good. All the light we cannot see by Anthony Doerr. Good book. I mean, I think a lot of people can attest to uh, this story. Yeah, I I don't think I really remember the story as much as I would like to. So maybe. I should reread it. Okay, amateur. This is about gender and identity and masculinity. Can't wait to get into this. This bridge caught my back. Writings by radi radical women of color. Did I just mean radical? <laughs> this is how you walk on the moon. I was really excited to read this, but I just don't know why I never picked it up. Um, this is an uh, anthology of short stories. Um, a bit like sci-fi, apparently. The Body Keeps the Score, classic text that a lot of people recommend. Mm -hmm. Fear Intentions, uh, Amelia Abraham. Interesting book, can't wait to get into it. The Art of Charlie Chan, Chan Charlie Chan, not Chai. This was another um, text required for our common curriculum, so yeah, I had the hard copy. It's really good. I mean, um, if you're into graphic novels and you're into Singaporean history, this is like perfect. Um, yeah, Tony Liu is a great artist, um, really great, great artist. Japanese textbook. 32nd Philosophies. Um, I really, really like this book, but obviously it's like, it doesn't feature like a very diverse range of um, philosophers. Okay, so that's the end of my bookshelf thingy. I hope that was fun. Um, now I officially have a bookshelf background, so that must make me an official booktuber, right?
booktuber bookstagrammer i don't know but yeah um do let me know if you want like a more dedicated shelf tour where i talk through the books more in detail if not then yeah that's about it thanks for joining me for this particular run um happy to finally have a place to put all my books because they were just in the corner in piles so it's nice to give them a home yay okay so that's all and uh do like the video if you enjoyed it uh comment whether you know comment your own shelf i guess like how big is your shelf mine is pretty small and yeah i'll just see you in the next video i guess yeah um don't forget to to subscribe and share this video with other people if you think they'll like it too. Thanks for joining me and bye!